I really don't see why we had to leave the warthog behind. We had to ditch it. If we were going to go around this building, it would have taken an extra three days. Three days? For a building. Yeah, it's built into a mountain. Plus you gotta factor, you know, pee breaks, and lunch breaks, and stroke breaks. Don't you mean smoke breaks? Nope. You are a disgusting individual. Please help me! What the hell was that? I'm a hot girl in distress! Dibs. Thank you! You have no idea how scared I was! Well, you're a girl, so... First things first, we need to check you for bites. Make sure you're not infected. Dibs! <sighs> Go ahead, just be quick. Oh, trust me, I'm always quick. So, is there any way I could repay you for saving me? Well, since you asked... I don't see why I couldn't have checked her for bites. Because if you would have done it, we would have been here until God knows when, because the sight of real boobs would have sent you into a coma. Hey, I've seen plenty of boobs, okay? Your mom and sisters don't count. Yeah, they do. Hey guys, I'm back. What was with the gunshot and the moaning? Oh, that's simple. She turned into a zombie, so I had to shoot her. Um, the moaning came after the shot. Oh boy, I could sure use a distraction right about now. Well, well, boys. I see you made it past the defense systems. Wait, what defense systems? Please, follow me. I'll explain everything. Oh, of course he will. The script says he's the director. Guys, seriously, there were defense systems? Not that we're ungrateful for you taking us in like the Lost Boys, but who the hell are you? I am, or was, the director of this facility. We studied all kinds of things. Weapons, metal alloys, cocaine, and special serums. Special serums? Yes, specifically a super soldier serum. Ooh, like Captain America? No. Like Spartans? In a way, yes. We were trying to make a soldier we could control taking away his ability to think for himself so we could make his every move. That's pretty messed up, man. Yeah. No shit. That's why we got shut down. But the test subjects were released and, well, there were complications. What kind of complications? One of the subjects returned to his gay lover, and they were having some... Uh, how do I put this gently? They were shoving gerbils up their asses. Oh man, if I had a nickel for every time that happened. Wait, I'm confused. What are you trying to say? The gerbils got out, and after being in the subject's ass, they mutated. It started biting people, and, well, those people turned into zombies. I thought it was a meteor that caused it. That's the cover story we used. This is where it all really started. So, if this is where it all started, doesn't that mean you have some vaccine to cure it? Sadly, no. I've been trying to find one, but the only thing that seems to work is shooting them in the face. Well, thanks for the history lesson, but... We have to be on our way. Oh, and where is that? We have a kick-ass safe house that we're gonna hide in until this whole thing blows over. You realize this facility is impregnable, right? I've got auto sentries and ordnance you couldn't even dream of. Facility breach. Undead life forms detected. Well then, shall we get going? What do you mean, we? You're not gonna leave me, right? Well, yes. No, wait. Take me with you. And why should we do that? This facility. It was a military installation. We have a heavily supplied weapons depot. Take me with you and I'll show you where it is. Huddle up. I don't know about you guys, but I smell bullshit. Wait, there's a bull in here? Seriously, dude. With a fucking rubber chicken. Let's call a vote. Aye. Aye. When did this become a fucking democracy? We've agreed to take you with us. We didn't agree on shit. I didn't even know what we were voting on. Here it is, boys. Well, it's about time the military was good for something. I think I'm in love. Oh, rubber chickens. Perfect. 